What's up guys and welcome to episode 3 of Xenoverse and if you guys missed the last two episodes I definitely recommend checking them out before I show off the team. Alright, you had enough time. So, team, let's eat level 10 Beedrill, Focus Band, Swarm Ability, it's going to be a rough time. Uh, if you guys are enjoying what I'm doing here in the series uh, and you know enjoying my suffering apparently, <clears throat> make sure you hit that like button and if you're new to the channel make sure you hit that sub button for all the new content that's coming through. <clears throat> Now, I have a pizza cooking in the oven, so I'm going to try to, like, you know, get it going in here, make sure that we get something done here in this episode. Um, I had something else. Oh, right. Series for this, um, schedule for this series. Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. Just wanted to make sure I had that in another beginning of an episode, because I feel like I completely missed it in the last one. Because I was on like just a rush time frame, so I got nervous. I am really gonna need a poison. I really want a better like move in general. Okay, that's gonna do nothing. Even with a crit. I think my camera just turned off. Okay. That was weird. I don't know if that's gonna come through recording, but like my like as far as I saw my camera just like went black for a second. But it's fine. Oh, uh, I really hope there's a new encounter. I don't want to keep using poison staying this entire game. <clears throat> oh, so... I was thinking about something um, today uh, about this game, like, obviously, because that's what we're going to talk about for a second here. So, I noticed, like, the first time um, that I was, like, looking at our main character when you, like, go outside the ranch when you're, like, five... That, like, it seemed like you have, like, a different color, like, tips on your hair. But then whenever you, like, jump to your older age, you have white tips. And I can't figure out if it's just, like, um... I can't figure out if you're supposed to, like, a cloned person or something. Like, it, it seems like it's very strange and little detail. But I feel like it's an important detail in the game. Oh, bro, we, we super resist in that. Hit it all five times, I'm pretty sure. Oof. Just a dice of poison. Gee whiz. Oh, and for anyone who is curious, uh, my back is feeling better. Um, hot shower, um, ibuprofen, um, some icy hot, and um, some decent, like, rest seem to have done the job decently, but... I I went ahead and also scheduled a massage appointment because I'm a little bit worried about um, something like that happening again. So I wanted to be safe about it. Also, there's probably going to be a break in this episode somewhere um, where I'm going to go and have to like pull out the pizza. So just be prepared. Uh, I can't believe I'm soloing with a B drill. I'm a little bit sorry that like I keep saying it, but like, how often have you had to solo with a B drill in a, in an in an LP? Like, really, 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 really. All right. Ooh, that looks like an Elekid, but a fire type. Wow, that was fat. Oh, I don't even remember what voice you had, honestly. Oh, let's try something. I cornered it. But I want you to fight it to prove to me how, um, how much you are worth. Now pay attention. As I told you, this crook comes from another world, so it's impossible to catch it with common Pokeballs. Therefore, I've developed a ball capable of imprisoning the explosive fury of X species Pokemon. Here are the results of years of research. Eh. All right. Let me tell you something. Studies on these Pokemon reveal that they have multiple HP bars. Despite the trouble it makes, this Elekid is not especially strong. So it has two bars maximum. As for normal Pokemon, also these ones must be weakened to be caught. Before we get started in this battle, let me kill your Pokemon. I mean, that's nice, but like, I need... I need more, like, I'm pretty sure it's gonna just burn me away. Well. 
I am terrified right now. Please help. Boss Elegant? Please tell me it's at least like a... No, Dark Type's not gonna help. Actually, I mean... Oh, they're like Totem too. Oh boy. I, I'm, I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan. Please help. Please help. That did 10. I guess it really could be worse. But I'm not gonna like it if he keeps doing it like that. Bro, can I at least get a poison? Oh boy. I don't like it, I don't like it. At least I can heal though. That's like a pretty big thing. Cause like I've been so used to playing Radical Red recently where you can't heal like in um, in most battles. Like, I guess it's just trainer battles, but it feels like more than that. Hey, there we go, there we go. All right, he's trying to juke me out with his leer and quick tax. I know I'm two two stages down, and he did five before. Uh, I'm not gonna get hit with a crit right now and lose. I gotta play extra safe. Actually, uh, if I'm trying to catch it, I really should start throwing balls at it now. I only have five. I'm gonna still go for it though. I get to poison, I've got a status condition on it. Let's see how we go. Mm, let's go! Mm, not just using a B drill anymore. Oh boy. I don't know what green collector is. All right, let's check out this little bomb boy. All right, you're pure fire type dynamite Pokemon. Uh, the sparks it scatters from its head can easily cause fires or explosions, and it a wait what? It is a real tickle ticking bomb. I don't know why I said tickling. Um, I don't know what this is are for either, but you know. Uh, let's go ahead and add him to layout though. I don't. I guess his name has a bunch of Z's in it. I don't know what was happening. <clears throat> I knew you'd manage it easily. Time to go back to the lab. <clears throat> I have to say that you made awesome work out there. Congratulations. I was sure you'd be able to handle this all on your own. Anyway, welcome to my lab. This is where I run my research on X Pokemon. It's here where... Mm, it's here where, only thanks to mutual respect, we received the Xeno Ball. The only device capable of containing the power of those mysterious creatures. We don't even know how many X specimens are still lurking in the Eldwe region. I don't think I'm saying that right. But one thing is sure. They are they're a serious threat to its balance. You have to be ready for anything. If you want to become a real trainer, I suggest you challenge the gym leaders of the region. You see, also Hadworth City has a gym. Hey, Daisy. Why don't you start with that? Oh man, I was so into this conversation that I lost sense of all time. Sense of time. All sense of time. Cloud, I better go now, or I'd be late to the meeting. Take care. Okay. Uh, I'm guessing that's a PC over here on the left. Uh oh. I am currently poisoned. Um. Well, I don't like that. Uh, am I in the Pokemon Center right now? No, I'm definitely in the lab. Uh, well, I think I have an antidote. But I can't move over in the stupid bag. Seriously, I... I would prefer just having a like scroll bag like just up and down and then being able to move side to side. I'm just not a big fan of the have to hit certain keys to move over in your bag. But I guess I could always like key bind them to more keys. And stop like complaining like a baby about it. 
I'll mess with it later. What, my Pokemon? Are you talking about this? It's a Porygon Center, a device that uh, provides all the comforts of a Pokemon Center at the price of $500. Inside the tricky dungeon scattered through Eldwe, um, it's a real glimmer of hope for trainers. Uh, where there's Porygon centers, there's home. Oh, I guess I could have paid $500 um, to heal. This lab is huge if only I had my Pokedoll with me. Oh, well, I guess I'm glad I got it. Okay, well, I guess I'll go talk to him then. Um, here I do nothing but fill in paperwork over paperwork. Okay. How to s wait, what? Okay, she's explaining sound typing. Great. Strong against water, flying, and fairy. Okay, and they're weak against dragon and electric. Okay. They're strong against fairy? Fairy fire? Is that what it said? Fairy flying and water. Okay, so you're like really good against like a wingle. Uh, let's see, it seems other regions don't study sound type as closely. No kidding. I feel like someone here would give me something. Hey, there we go. Free Xenoble. Let's go. Alright, I don't think there's anything. Oh, wait. Hiding in here. Alright, yeah, I think that's all we got. <sighs> uh, I'm gonna go talk to the old man real quick and then I'm gonna get healed. Let's figure out what's got here. Hey, let's go, great ball. I'm gonna start listening for uh, my timer to go off uh, for my pizza because I don't want it to like burn or start a fire or something crazy like that. Well, I'm definitely happy to have a second Pokemon now. That's a big relief off of me. And there's my timer. All right. Um, I will come back here in a bit. Uh, won't be any bit for you then. So let me just. All right. I just finished my nice and tasty pizza. Um, I'm just gonna remind myself real quick what the heck I was just doing. Okay, uh, so I got the yellow kid. Um, I don't really know. I guess I do know what I need to do next. I'm pretty sure you have to like go into the gym now. Um, because I only have two Pokemon, I kind of want to train like a little bit of the yellow kid and maybe see like if I can get another encounter if I go all the way up the Stardust Beach. <laughs> yeah. They made that a whole little maze when I really don't feel like it needed to be. Uh, can I just... Yeah. You know, between the times of me eating that pizza, I really should have uh, set up my controller. Oh. Um. So this feels very much like a static mon right now. So I I, I want to be able to catch it. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna catch it, and then I'm like look around on the beach and make sure like it's not like overly common. But like if it's like there's like one or two of them, then I probably won't like allow one. But I'm still gonna allow the capture. And a lot of it is just because I need more Pokemon. And I don't really want to lose this right now. But I also feel like this is like different because you're not like running around in an area. Like it's something that's like just statically there, which is like the point of the word static Pokemon. So like it's kind of similar to legendaries in that sense. I wouldn't put Sandy Gas on the same level as a legendary, but you know, it's it it's it's there. He's there. Let him be, you know. Why can I not catch this thing? 
I'm just glad he doesn't have a ground type move, it looks like. <clears throat> Honestly, if I can have um, two Pokemon, three Pokemon, I mean. What is happening? It's just triple jiggles all day long, apparently. Also, I've kind of noticed um, more recently, like in my streaming and recording, I tend to hold my shoulder like this a lot. And I know it's kind of like a nervous thing, like whenever I'm feeling a little bit like anxious or nervous, like I just kind of like want to like hold on. And I feel like I didn't notice it until like very recently. It likes uh, the shovel on its head. So Sandy Guest will get serious and fight any children who come to take it. I would love to see that. Okay, we're still doing the Z thing, and I really don't know why. Oh, I think I do know why. Yep. It's because my auto run was set. Mm-hmm. Fisher, okay. I was trying- there's a- there was a brand I was trying to think of, and it's like Fisher Price. Um, but once you make a lot of like the plastic toys for kids. <clears throat> All right, let me check him out real quick. Ooh, he's got a pearl. Water compaction. Boost its defense when it's hit by a water to move. That's pretty good. It's not, it's, it's okay. Not, like, not great, but like, you know, you know. Had absorb too. I'll just take that pearl. That's money. Okay, so there are a few throughout here. So I'm still going to let the one go through. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna let any more go through, though. The items in the bag can be moved by pressing Z. It's a piece of cake. Okay. I thought that was saying, like, I can eat cake or something, and I'm like, what is this talking about right now? But I guess it would help if I read things all the way through. Ooh, more money. Let's go. Maybe that's why they call it Stardust Beach. Because there's just random things of Stardust all around. Yeah. I would say because there are like just a bunch of pile of sands, like I'm just gonna do the thing I said where I'm just gonna allow the one that I have and no, no more and just count as a static Pokemon. Um I don't wanna see if this uh Staryu is also static. No, okay, so like it's only the sand castles. Yeah, I'm definitely just gonna let it go through and have that just be a thing. Is this like Mr. Briny, but oh it is, it's just older Mr. Briny! Oh I love that. Oh mm -hmm. I love Salem, but nobody has joined me in years now. Oh can I talk to Pico? Can, can I can I get around the tree and talk to Pico? Oh, I wanna talk to Pico. I know my Pokemon. I know what the bird's name is. Uh, I'm pretty weak right now. Um, pretty sure, like, the rest of this episode is gonna be another, like, uh, grinding thing, because, like, uh, I've got to drain up, train up two Mon now. There's not really much more I can do about it, so. I've got a rare candy, but I'm not gonna use the rare candy right now. I'd actually rather sell it, to be honest. And then I get more out of that. All right, let's train up the yellow kid first, and then we'll train up Fisher. I wonder if I'm missing some like the um, font text for the game, and that's why it keeps showing the eyes really weird. Because like that is uh, kind of annoying. All right. Uh, I mean, I guess the Sandy Gast were like level five. I think that's a higher level than everything else that's here, right? No, not really. Let's see, this thing's definitely a fighting type. Is it anything else, though? I think it's normal. I bet it's fighting normal. Um, I kind of want to talk about the pizza I just had because it was, like, really tasty pizza. It was just, like, your classic, like, Totino's pizza. Like, you know, you throw it in for, like, you know, 13 minutes, it's done. You ha it, it's triple cheese, like... 
It's just like a very like, ooh. Did I just say I got a black belt from him too? You know, you know, you know, these, 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 these controls are just, mm-hmm. Oh boy. I'm, I'm fixing these controls so I stopped complaining about them. I'm just tired of complaining about it. There we go. It literally is like that easy. Oh, so you actually get the items off Pokemon whenever you faint them too. That's pretty cool. Uh, I'll 100% give the Black Belt to Elekid since he just got low kick. And now if I wanted to, I can actually test out... My brain's blanking. My brain's blanking. Oh, I remember. I can test out if you min is also a normal type. Like, I think it is. Uh, you know, kid can fight this thing. Um, what was your stat layout again? I want to say you're a better physical attacker. Yeah, you... Oh, man, no wonder you have perfect IVs in attack. Uh, I'm pretty sure Ember's gonna do about the same, though. Just because Taylor's so light, too. Oh, heck yeah, let's go. If I'm still uh, grinding at the end of this episode, then I'm probably just going to um, grind between episodes because I highly doubt that anything's really going to happen of importance. It's like, you know, I don't want to you guys sit through the entire next episode and also have nothing happening. That's just not interesting at all. Ooh, man. I might see if I can find the name Raider and see if I can get El Kid an actual name. Like, I think I had something kind of in mind, but I wouldn't mind getting that done. I wonder if there's a way to turn off an experience share in this game. Because, like, once I get Elekid to level, I don't want everyone else also getting the experience. No, there isn't. It's, just, it's auto. Unless it's in settings. Uh, no. It's controls. Yeah, no. Okay, so, like, the experience share is just completely auto. But I guess that's part of the game. Because I'm pretty sure it asked me at the beginning if I wanted, like, like modern or classic style, I think it was. And I went with, like, modern where everything gains experience. So I guess I didn't factor that, that in. Oh, I almost got Elekid to level. I don't think I've had, I would have any easier time against Sandy Gas to fight them. I just don't really want to be running back to the Pokemon Center a ton fighting Wingle. Kind of weird, I haven't... There we go. I was about to say, I haven't seen a single Yamin since the first battle. It's been like Talos. Alright. Tell me if it's normal type. Yep. Knew it. I think I said I picked up another black belt. Yep. Cool. I mean, I'm not mad. Like, black belts could be really good. Uh, I was going to go ahead and switch low kick with Ember. Uh, I'll just do that. It's not really gonna matter for you, Sandy Gast. You don't really have a lot to hit anything with. Like, I think the best thing you can hit is the Wingles, and that's not great. I still don't really want to fight them. I'm pretty sure I could beat them, but then I'm gonna have to run back to Pokemon Center too. There we go. I can fight a Dwebble. I got Low Kick. Powered up Low Kick. One shot. Hey. That's how I picked up something else too. Ooh, I picked up a rare bone. Ooh. Okay, I'm making good money right now. I think I am probably just gonna get Elekid to level, and then we're just gonna go ahead and end it off. Uh, so you guys don't have to sit through the entire grinding of Sandy Gas, because I feel like that's gonna be kind of annoying. 
definitely something I should have to suffer. give good experience, so I will take this. Thank you. And another black belt. If black belts could sell for good money, it wouldn't be bad to farm them, but it seems like actually farming off the webbles might be better. And you guys remember in the last episode when I encountered a double? Good times. Hey, there we go. Alright, that's level 10. Alright, so you guys don't have to sit through the entire grinding. I'm going to go ahead and end it off now. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. It looks like we will not be losing immediately in this, as far as I can tell. So, we'll be taking on the first gym in the next episode, coming out on Friday. So, I hope to see you guys there. But until then, peace out, and stay safe. Later, guys.